the other thing that we've talked a little bit about is the upgrade at the um, at the offensive line position. Beyond Wyatt Teller, who is it? Chris Hubbard. Who are you looking at? And I know we'll know for sure next Friday when they start trotting people out. But but who are the candidates to be that right guard? You know, you mentioned Hubbard. I, I think he's a guy to keep an eye on. But the name I just keep coming back to, and, and it's one I mentioned a little earlier, is Nick Harris. I, they drafted him in the fifth round, and, and he's a center. He, he played center his last two years uh, in college, but he's also got experience at guard. And they have J.C. Treader, who just signed an extension. He's still in the prime of his career. I, I just don't think there's any rush to move on from J.C. Treader. So did they really draft a guy to be their backup center? Which is really, if you need a backup center, you can go find somebody. I, I think Nick Harris is going to have something to say about this right guard battle before all is said and done. I think he's going to get a chance, and, and if he's ready to go, it wouldn't surprise me if he's the starter on September 13th. I think Wyatt Teller is your front runner sort of by default, but I'm just keeping an eye on Nick Harris. Uh, the the more you hear people talk about it, uh, Jedrick Wills with the Browns, I think the more comfort you find in him being able to make that transition to left tackle. Um, that's not an easy thing to do, but it, it sure seems like they're going to find a way to have Jedrick Wills be as successful as possible. And then the good thing is you sign Jack Conklin on the right side, so you don't have to worry about that side of the line. So if you have to devote some resources maybe to helping out your left tackle, and he's got as good a left guard as there is in football and Joel Batonio next to him, you can stick a tight end over there if, if you absolutely need to. Ultimately, it's going to be on Jedrick Wills to, to take those steps to be a guy who eventually can be on an island and, and protect the quarterback's blind side. But – you can at least trust Jack Conklin to do that a little bit on the right side. So maybe you can sort of you know, shade some things over to help Jedrick out as, as he's getting ready. And the really good thing for him is he's got a great offensive line coach in Bill Callahan. If you want anybody teaching him how to make that transition, it's Bill Callahan. 